RV prepper is Wayne here. Uh, I got it running. Uh, got my belts replaced. The only belt that I didn't replace was the AC belt. Uh, but I got them all replaced. Um, I'm working on a, a something for the grill. I'll kind of show you all that uh, here after a bit. Uh, that's what it looks like now. It'll look different here after, later on. RV prepper is Wayne here. Uh, another project I'm working on. Look. I have no grill. Uh, see these headlights? For long they're getting changed. Uh, I found a uh, conversion kit. I can use the H4 bulbs and get uh, better light. I was driving at night. Uh, them headlights, uh, they are absolute horrible. Um, but what I'm doing to the grill is I'm, at, I'm going to be uh, painting the inserts in here. So what I'm doing is I'm masking it off and taking a razor blade and I'm cutting everywhere uh, that way I keep the chrome part uh, I'm, I'll clean the chrome part up once I get everything else painted so um, I'm taping everything off and then like I said I'm taking the razor blade and I'm going around I still gotta tape the uprights here tape around here uh, I got around here and then I'm going to tape all this top side because I want the uh, I want the inside part of this grill uh, to be black and I think the black with the chrome uh, facing will actually uh, kind of stand out and look nice um, so I'm going to uh, work at this uh, I'll try to uh, once I get it all taped up I'll show y'all and you can kind of see what I'm doing. Um, I'm just going to tape around the uh, the emblem. The emblem ain't worth a, a hoot, but uh, you know it's old. Um, getting the screws out was fun. I had to drill some of them out, so I got to get different screws. All the retaining clips that held in for the top side, uh, every one of them broke. So I'm I've got to replace. I think there were six of them, so I got to replace place them um, but let me get uh, getting everything taped up and then I'll show you what it looks like okay I got the grill taped up uh, it's about two hours in the taping in the masking and uh, the trimming of everything I still got one little spot to trim um, but as you can tell I've got it all masked off where I don't want any paint uh, so that way, uh, you know, I still have the chrome accent in there, but I have the black to the black will be in there, and that chrome will just kind of accent it a, a little bit. So uh, I'm gonna go ahead and uh, trim this one little piece of tape here. I'm gonna go ahead and paint this, and then uh, I'll kind of show y'all what it looks like. I won't be able to. I'm not gonna pull the paint off or the the tape off just yet. Um, but I might, I don't know. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and get, uh, get some paint on it and, uh, see how it looks. Uh, see y'all here in a minute. Well, I have the grill in now and, um, I went ahead and washed the whole, uh, front area and scrubbed it down and everything. But, uh, look at that grill now. That is just, uh. Uh, looks a lot better you know when I taped you, you know there's you still see a little black you know that's I'm not worried about that but from the distance and off to the side from a distance and off to the side that just looks a lot better And see, that's little things you can do uh, to make a vehicle look nicer. 
Uh, yeah, probably got about. Uh, uh, by the time taping and painting and uh, everything, I probably got about four hours work here in the uh, in the grill, cleaning up, polishing all that chrome and everything. And it just makes it look so much nicer. Uh, it's amazing with uh, the cheap rattle can spray paint and a little bit of time how you can make something look uh, a lot better. I like to look at that better than uh, than before. Uh, what I'll do is I'll add uh, some before and after picture and uh, you know side by side, and uh, you can kind of see what it looks like. Questions or comments, please like and subscribe. You can also catch me on Facebook. That's facebook.com backslash RV Prepper. Thanks for watching. See you in the next video.